Hey, you are probably here if you have tried to play World at War multiplayer and noticed that the field of view is restricted in the game to a maximum value of 80 degrees. I'm going to show you how to change it to a value exceeding the limit of 80 using a hex editor. This is not a perfect solution and I will discuss it more in the end of the video. But for now, here's how to do it. First, you will need a hex editor. I'm using a program called HXD to do this but any similar program will work. I will have the HXD download link in the video description. After you have the hex editor installed, locate the World at War install folder. For me it's in my games folder on a different drive but for Steam users, the default is in the Steam install folder on your C drive. I recommend backing up the game executable somewhere in case something goes wrong. Next open up the game executable with HXD. You can do it in the HXD program via file, open or just drag the MP executable to the HXD icon. Next you will see the game executable in a hexadecimal format. On the left you can see a column of 8 character addresses. You will need to find the right address that has values for the field of view. In World at War, one such value is in address 004A3240. Just scroll down until you find it. You can also try to use the search function but it didn't work for me for some reason. After finding the correct address, you should see the values 82 and 42 next to each other on the 06 and 07 offset. These are the values to be changed. The value must be in hexadecimal format so you will need to convert the desired value to hexadecimal. For example, to get 90, you need to replace 82 with B4. You can convert numbers using this website and read the correct value in the hexadecimal representation window. Note that it will show the values in a different order. For values close to 80, the 42 part usually don't change. I will show you some common values you can use. After you have set a value, save your changes and then launch the game. When you join a supported server, your field of view should be now changed. If the server doesn't support it, you won't see any effect. Also if you join a server that doesn't support this, it will set the value to 80 until you restart the game. This has a few downsides. All this edit does is change the lower limit of accepted values for the field of view command, as you can see. This essentially breaks the command. If I try to edit the field of view after doing this, it will be broken in this weird state and doesn't change. Not a big issue but worth mentioning. Then there is the lack of support from most servers. The PDG server is about the only one I know you can do this in. Also, some may consider this cheating because it's done by editing the game executable itself so do it on your own risk. In addition, this method doesn't affect a DS field of view, so aiming down sights will zoom in a lot. A DS field of view is controlled by a different command called CG underscore Fofscale which cannot be edited, at least to my knowledge. Alternatively to this method, you could use the Plutonium mod. On Plutonium, all field of view commands, including the ADS Fofscale, have been unlocked by the developer and are freely editable with the console commands. In the end, I recommend using Plutonium if you want high field of view gameplay since it's natively supported there and the only server that supports it on the Steam and DVD versions also works on Plutonium. Use this only if you want to have your stats or don't want to install Plutonium for some reason.